and leave it there so that when you're leaving this place, we take her with us. All right. You start dragging her. Her head knocks against the wall and then knocks against the floor as you're dragging her. I don't know how to drag people. <laughs> you say that as then you drag her past these barrels and her head hits the barrel. Oh, my God. <laughs> And you realize this this little this little walkway in between the walls is not big enough to drag people. Okay, I need to find the entrance. <laughs> yeah. Then the doors open up. Ooh, I'm bringing you to the prison. You hear Alana screaming from the distance. Everyone. Which Burden. direction? West. Take take Shyla to the room. Oh, there she is. I uh, I grab um, Shyla. Wait, this is not. Wait, wait. And, uh, she, she's behind where she is. Alanis. Oh. She's dragging a body. Ah, <laughs> that's a table. <laughs> the door is just closed. Hello. All the doors are locked. I'm gonna run at the uh, the door down here and try to break it open. You run at the door down there, but the moment you're about to make contact, the door opens, you fall through it, and you come out to a different location. Okay. And you stumble back into the room. Slam my fist on the ground. You slam your fist on the ground, and uh, a little face appears in the floorboards. I punch it. I punch, punch it. it, and mm, that's the wrong one. Make an intelligence save. Dirt starts crawling up your skin from your fist, from out of the mouth of that little figure you saw, and it starts. Dirt goes up your hand up your arm, up your shoulder, it starts going into your mouth. You will not be able to make actions for a bit. The doors are closed. She's not letting us leave this room. She knows that the thief is here. We can't let her escape. Can't it must mean steal. that all the items are here. Since she won't let us go look for them anymore. Hello, Anis. Hello! Doppelganger, what have you stolen from my mistress? Oh, you're talking to me? You're talking to me? Are you talking to me? He says at you, nods. I don't know what you're talking about. The yeah, whole house starts shaking. I don't know what you're talking about. She doesn't like liars. Nope. Did you find anything that has to do with a wedding, Alanis? I uh, waiting. What you? The stuff for the wedding is right there. The dress, flowers. Where is the husband and where is the bride? Okay, the fiance. We need the and ring. The bride. I don't know what you're talking about. The walls are closing in. Yeah, hey, I'm just pulling uh, Lohan away from the walls. As you do that, Lohan starts coughing up mounds of dirt, and he can act again. We need the ring. <laughs> that was real. We're missing only the ring. A ring? What kind of ring? The walls start closing in closer. I uh, I run up to Clyde and um, uh, threaten him. Um, make it stop. I'm not in control of this. She is. Lana, just give us the ring before we die. What kind of ring? Sounds like a shitty place to die. What kind a wedding of ring? ring. I don't know what is a wedding ring. I never got married. I have a plenty of rings, you know that. Mm. La 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 la. Oh, la la la. The one you found in this house. Oh. The halfling jumps at Alanis. It starts trying to rip at her uh, bags. In satchels. Ah! You can't! You can't do this to the mistress! He says. Get out of here! Ah! Ah! Guys! You 
starting to get my food. No, don't you can use uh, athletics to knock them off. Or strength. Athletics. Let me see. Athletics. athletics. You fail. He knocks you to the floor. <laughs> Give my but he pulls from your hand, or from your from your bags, gold bar and a ring. He just That's tosses awesome. it to the center. And the room no. goes dark. No. Can I grab my gold bar? Loha deflects missiles and catches the ring. <laughs> I want to get my gold bar back. <laughs> Give me my stuff. Money Your for food. stuff. Money hmm. for food. Very interesting. <laughs> Shala? Mm hmm. You hear wedding bells. Oh my god. <laughs> That's gonna be so creepy. Shala's gonna be dressed as um, like a um, bride. And she's gonna be like. Whoa. Everyone else starts to hear wedding bells. <laughs> you look all around you. You're sitting in chairs and pews, and around you are all your friends, frozen and petrified, and they look like dolls. I don't see anything. And there is the lovely figure of Alanis Lynn, with the petrified Cassidy Lynn, standing on the altar. That doesn't look like someone needs to perform the ceremony. He will step up to the challenge. That doesn't look lovely. <laughs> <laughs> what what are we all wearing? If that's, if that's her lovely... <laughs> yeah, actually, what am I wearing? What, what are we all wearing right now? What you were wearing before. So it's okay. all five down. But all five of us are active and mobile. Everybody else is petrified? Yep. Bassinet is there? Petrified. Like turned to stone? or Like turned to the material that old creepy dolls are made out of. That weird plastic. Mm, and as if old powdered makeup had been put all over his face. Oh, what is the body of the woman that I saved? Hmm. I'll do it. So, as you step up to the podium, you realize that everyone here is still alive. And if you do this, you'll basically be selling away Kazgard's soul to whatever this creature is. Do you still wish to try to perform the ceremony? Uh, can I whisper something to you quick, though? Sorry, what's that? I'm just going to whisper something to you quick. All right. She has her wedding dress on. The petrified form of Kaskar has the ring. Do I see a bouquet? You have a bouquet of flowers in your hand. Okay. That's, yeah, that's me. Um, so sorry, Doc, can you explain it again? So, yeah, if you, you're actually going to force Cadgar into a contract where you, you sell his soul to whatever this creature is. If you perform okay. the ceremony. If you're fine with that, yeah, go ahead and go through with it. Who's Cadgar then? Cadgar Lynn? Mm -hmm. The previous lord of this house, the brother of Marshall Lynn? Oh, brother of Marshall Lynn, I see, I see, sorry, sorry. Someone has to take the place, and no one stepped in. Karoon. Yes? You, you can't do this. Of course he can. 
she needs to get married. <laughs> and who's better than her past was husband's brother? <laughs> <laughs> I start saying this, and uh, the face of the banshee starts turning from a smile to a grimace. I uh, I wink at Lohan. Can we just throw one iPhone at? Um. Crap! I'm not exactly sure how to respond. Oh, yeah. I yell. Oh, respond. <laughs> Um, I'm just going to do an arcana check up to, to confirm my suspicion. You're not trained in arcana, are you? Um, no, but I get I get plus four for it. I'm going to shoot my arrow. Yes, but if you're not trained in it, then your information received is going to be extremely limited. You've done no formal training. You can recognize stuff, but you can't discover answers like the ones you want. Okay. Ivern, what are you going to do? Uh, I'm kind of waiting to see what happens. I think I don't want to get involved. With a 14 Karun on untrained Arcana, you do know um, that this will be a binding seal, that you are going to sentence a man, soul, to be forever bound or consumed. And beyond that, you don't know anything else. Okay, so I wouldn't be able to recognize, like, Point in between those two finalities. Not really. She's a targetable um, thing. Like, can I shoot like my arrow on her? You can try. Oh. I, I'm gonna stand up and try to shoot my arrow. Awesome. So you stand up, you pull your arrow back, and you fire it. And the figure kind of fades away. I turn back and look at Alanis. What? But the wedding? The wedding must be complete. Everyone roll initiative. Oh, shit. Yeah. Oh, after all that, to get out of the situation without combat. <laughs> you almost did it, man. <laughs> Someone had to ruin someone else's wedding because she was jealous. You're just basically... Well, that- you're basically replaying the same situation that happened to her. I don't like that she, woman. <laughs> she doesn't look at, like me at all. She's got white hair just like you. Well, that's because she's a ghost. Maybe yeah, it's your mother. Ghost. Mine is naturally. <laughs> hey, a that ghost white hair is naturally white as well. Thank you very much. I was about to say, that would be perfectly in character for someone clumsy like Alanis to try to shoot her own mother. That's not my mother. So if she was, that would How be do you awesome. know? How do you know she's not your mother? Well, she would have been nice and let me have my gold and the ring. Your mother never let you have jewels like that when you were young. Maybe your twin <laughs> sister. Yeah, Gave exactly. you the same name for some reason. I don't know, that's suspicious. You're suspicious. That too. <laughs> I don't um, see a lot is on the turn order. Yeah, same. Well, so you want to reroll your thing while clicking on your character? I already did. Yeah, oh, that's probably worse. Well, I already did. Mine oh, look, ominous up. music. Thanks a lot. Oh, yeah, it does say that she rolled an 11. Yeah, just click on your character and roll again. See what happens. Gotcha. There you go. Booyah. Yeah, that's, that's better. Did the ghost actually roll zero? That's sad. No, I haven't rolled yet. <laughs> oh, no, go ahead and roll again. <laughs> 18. Sorry, Brady. Um, just, just to this clarify. is going to be a hard fight, guys. I really hope it's not a real banshee. Sorry, sorry, we have that? zero magical items to damage this thing with. Zero. I yep. have a banjo that it's a saxophone that it's magical. We just need someone that can play that. All right, well, that is I'm not sure. Sure. You have pissed off the banshee, and you have set all these events in motion again, and potentially doomed everyone around you. Well, because I'm pretty nice, right? <laughs> Sorry, guys. So, 
Well, her figure looms over the house and the entire house itself 